obfuscation tools part three we try to understand how to use by armor advantages and cons of by armor and a bonus understand how to use by armor you need to read the documentation for more information but first installing by, uh, by armor using pip pip install by armor then obfuscation using the command the command by armor obfuscate my script pump by note you can use also by armor obfuscate recursive my script pump by will uh, also obfuscate by files inside subfolders of the project if you want to obfuscate all the programs like if you have uh, like uh, a uh, program and you want that have a lot of uh, modules and uh, by files inside it you can use recursive so understand how to use by armor usually you can generate also an expired license for obfuscated script so you can generate an expired license so this license will expire for example uh, like this and uh, the problem here is that first we need to generate a license then we're gonna use the license to with obfuscation okay uh, advantages and cons of by armor uh, by armor use license for personal or enterprise uses the free version will make the licensing different because anyone can generate a license for your obfuscated code the code will still be obfuscated but they can also generate uh, licenses, licenses for themselves uh, by more at the end is still a tool anyone can reverse engineer it uh, reverse engineer it and uh, make their own obfuscation tool the naming of function and variables will always be lost but by the careful observation we can rename them to what they are used for Bonus. If you are freelance, you wish to send your client a demo version of your code, you could use this method. Uh, you, you create your Python code, then you add your own licensing code, then use PyArmor for obfuscation.